What's going on guys, Vic VP back with another Game Case Arcades video. We're talking about the Touch Edition here and basically we're going to go over the main first four categories which is using Itbox Emulator. Cowabunga! Let's kick shell! Pizza power! So just a quick backstory on how this all started. There is a file up online from Aladdin called Ultimate Aladdin Pack or whatever. He had like 600 games on it. It was really meant for Windows XP. Basically I downloaded it. It's how I started this kind of file. Um, I had to literally test all 500 games as they did not work. And basically I took all the games that did work on a Windows 10 PC and then I made my own list out of it. So basically on the main menu here, you're gonna see a bunch of categories here. So I kind of divided it into like actual categories like trivia, fun, and car games. The main thing that we're gonna be talking about in this video today is the first four. So, so the first four trivia, fun zone, card, and word games are using an emulator called Itbox. That's really like the emulator that's almost like the mega touch. So any game like that, you're gonna find it in the first four. The other remaining ones here are really PC executable files, like game files. So we're gonna be discussing those in a later one, but for right now, we're gonna be focusing on the first four. So I had it all set up. Trivia is trivia, obviously. Fun Zone, I made it, I called it Fun Zone. It's basically games that are fun, like you know, you'll see Boggle and basically interactive games, some flip cards, matching games, and all that. Then you'll have like card games and word games too. So real quick, we're gonna start off with trivia. Um, there was a lot of trivia. I'm not a big fan of trivia, but there was a ton of trivia games. Um, but basically there's a bunch of pages. So you go change the pages here, change the pages here. There are a couple of games that don't look like trivia. That was like the big thing that kind of fooled me. Like we see we have like Connect 4. There's two different versions of it, but I have Connect 4 and at first I would think it was the actual Connect 4. No, it actually turns out to be like a quiz game. So we're gonna load up um, a trivia game just for kicks to show you. Uh, Donkey Derby, this is pretty cool, I'll be honest. Um, Basically, again, you play it, you'll pick your horse. Let's go Vic. Oh, this one's Vic, wow. <laughs> I can't tell if they did it on purpose. Uh, but basically, you answer the questions. We're gonna try to get to the finish line. Again, I'm not good at these, so let's see how we do. In January, yeah, this, nope, like no idea. What wavelength is required? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> what would you measure with an altimeter? Um, alts? Great, I don't know. I'll compare the film with the, I got one. Which river flows through? I don't know. See, like, this is why me and, like, trivia is just a nightmare. I'm right now just guessing. I'm not even reading it because my horse is just so far back. And that's it. Again, trivia is not my forte, but it's pretty cool. Notice, though, that most of the games do play in full screen, as you see here. There are about 5% of the games that don't launch in full screen. I don't know who to blame for, either the emulator or the ROM itself. I think it's the ROM itself. Um, but I'm gonna load up a game that shows you that. So for example, Connect 4, it doesn't load full screen. There's no way to change it, I can't change it. But again, we'll play another one just to show you. So it gives you two options for two player or one player. In this specific game, if you were doing two player, it's actually regular Connect 4, but one player is actually like a trivia thing. So as you can see on the bottom here, we have a bunch of categories. Um, I don't, let's just see, see? No clue, I don't know, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna embarrass myself on this. I'll give myself a free spot. Who died after Ben, I, I don't know. <laughs> it wouldn't be Marilyn Monroe, but okay. Unless it is, I don't know. Let's try again. Again, I, I don't know these, this is just, see, and then game over. So keep that in mind, when you do wanna exit the game, you wanna finish the game, you have to wait for the game to end. Again, keep in mind, you would actually have paid money to play this. Basically, you exit out one button, one button only, let it go back to its screen, and now we're back. That's trivia. Again, it's pretty basic. There's a lot of trivia. It's fun. Me, personally, I don't like trivia. I'm just not good at it, as you could see. So there's a lot of stuff. Next one we'll do is Fun Zone. Uh, fun Zone, again, is basically random games that aren't trivia, card games, or word games. Um, you'll see, like, Boggle. Um, you'll see like uh, I have like a basketball one and such now the big thing to also note is that there are like three or four um, Adult games I would say like naughty games. They're not naughty It's just kind of pictures if you do want me to remove them. Let me know we could remove them It's very easy to remove them. So again, this right here is the fun zone. I saw one I did I was playing it with my wife um, It was hoops shooting hoops Pretty cool. I mean again, it's kind of like the the um, mega touch game 
The mega touch game you would actually have to slip up. This one you just kinda kinda just play you just press the basketball player. And just pray that one of them goes in. And again, they do have full audio. I just have the audio low for the video. And again, right now, like I said, if you wanted to exit this, there is no way to exit it. You have to let the time run out. So keep in mind, like right now, you know, it's going slow, but as you progress, it will go faster. So this right now, I'm killing it right now. <laughs> But yeah, so basically again, any fun zone game is like this. Again, it's just not, it's not a trivia game, it's not a word game, it's not a card game. So there's, there's very cool stuff. Boggle's cool, a lot of word games and such. So again, we're going over the first four categories, uh, basically using the it box emulator. So right now we're just waiting for the, the clock to drain out. Again, you there is no way to exit this game. You must let the game end, and basically then you'll be able to go back to the menu. I got a new high score at least. Let's just see, will it let me exit? So I could put my name, awesome. And boom, yes, I'm able to exit and I could exit and bring it back into the home screen. So again, there's a lot of, a lot of stuff. Um, if somebody wants a game list, it is pretty easy. I could just upload the config file or snap a picture of it. Um, easy stuff, there's also like Fruit Ninja. I'll show you that real quick, that's a fun one. This actually really is a PC executable. Um, but we'll just leave it be for now. So again, all touchscreen, you can literally play any uh, touchscreen game on this. That's Fruit Ninja, we all know how to play it. I'm gonna quit and bring it back. So again, once you exit the, the program, it will bring it right back into the front end, which is awesome. We do some card games. These are not casino card games. These are like regular card games that like, you know, it's mostly it's solitaire, not a very big, um, uh, honest, like variety of it. Um, let's just see, uh, Texas Hold'em, you got solitaire. Um, somebody asked me if there was like a, like an adding one. Let's try this one. Tournament prize pyramids. I believe the objective is to do 21. You need a seven or a nine. It's probably good when you start these to make sure that you could do, that you should probably read the instructions. Five, four, three. It's almost like solitaire, I guess you could say. Nine, 10, 10, Jack, Queen, King. Yeah, once you get like the hang of it, you'll be good with it. Uh, two, nope, nine. How do I want to do this? Eight, seven, uh, five, four, five, four. Nope, check, 10, nine. Oh, I should have done 10. <laughs> Ace, king. Ace no, two no, three, damn. <laughs> so, I mean, again, as you can see, it is fun. They're, they're really cool. There's a couple of card games. Let's do like another one, um, just just for kicks. Uh, let's see. I mean, even like the previews, you get a couple of previews and such. Uh, I don't want to play Solitaire. Um, Towers, actually, like if it was a game that I just played, that was pretty fun. Um, let's do Dragon Triple Towers. So again, I tested all these and made sure the emulator does read the coins and such. Most of the games I found did not work. So I'm guessing it's the same thing. So seven, six, yep. Seven, six, nothing. Q, no. King, no. Four. Three. Four, two, one. I could take, I get rid of the ace. Two, yep. Ace, no. Eight, nine. Nope. Jack, queen, jack. I needed a 10. Oh, damn. Oh, five, four, five, 
for... <laughs> Some of you guys are watching me like, what is this guy doing? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There you go, that was a big combo, there you go. Ten, 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 ten. Jack, what do I want to do? Queen, king, I'd rather get rid of the two. No. King, no. Jack, ten, nine, ten. Ooh, four. Damn it, I think I lost. <laughs> Nine, come on. I don't think I won. I didn't even get the high score or anything, damn it. Yep. <laughs> so there you guys have it, another card game. Again, strictly card games, you will not find casino games on this. I'm gonna put my name, obviously. And again, once you exit, exit one time, one button only. If you do exit like twice, it'll think that the system crashed and you'll get a exit. Uh, it'll actually exit the whole emulator. Let's try word games. So again, a couple of them, like you'll see like, um, you know, it's really like making words and such. Um, not much here. Honestly, you'll find more word games on the pop cap and the big fish games. Uh, but for right now, let's do, uh, let's try string them. Again, these games I'm saying to you is that these are running an emulator called Itbox. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> There's so many words. Oh, I can't even go diagonal? Damn it. Oh, it somehow took that, okay. I'm not good on the pressure. <laughs> so three words work. Uh, can I go diagonal? No, I can't. I'm the type that I'd rather get smaller words, but I know the big words get you <laughs> more points. Oh, man. Damn. <laughs> Teeth was my biggest word. <laughs> it's like I see like citizen, but I can't go diagonal. And there is no randomizer. Oh. Bob, good old Bob. like be all over the board right now, but I ran out of time. <laughs> yeah. No win, obviously. <laughs> but I mean, there you go, there you have it. Let's do it, put our name into it, awesome. Again, you could exit out, 
Don't press anything here, it'll think it'll crash. And now we're back. Again, these are word games. Try to think of like boggle games and such. That's really it. Like I said, the main first four are based on the um, emulator uh, known as Itbox. The other ones here, honestly, are running uh, executables, which we'll talk on the next one, which is Casino.